Hi everyone, today we are gonna be making a simple sugar scrub out of a few ingredients that you may have at home or if you do not, you can get them at your local grocery store. First, we're gonna be taking a half a cup of granulated sugar and we're gonna pour that into our bowl. Next, we're gonna be using organic coconut cooking oil. We are using coconut oil for this specific recipe because we are gonna be making a pina colada scented sugar scrub. So this calls for one fourth cup of this coconut oil. And we are going to pour that over our sugar. And then we are going to mix that in well. If you're making um, any other types of sugar scrub. You also can use baby oil. Um, there's other types of cooking oil that you're able to use as well. This coconut gives us the island vibe that we're going for today. So when you mix that together, it's going to make almost like a, a like crunchy snow, like a snow cream type texture. And that sugar is really going to help get off uh, old and dead dry skin. It's going to leave your hands feeling silky smooth. Next, this is an optional step, um, but we are going to be using a yellow food coloring. It looks a little bit red in this bottle, but it's going to turn out to be a pretty summery yellow. And you can use as much or as little food coloring as you would like. I'm going to start with a couple of drops. And we're going to mix that in. almost like a bright orange and the more we mix it it gets into a nice golden yellow you're just gonna fold that into each other and you're also uh, welcome to use different colors of food coloring we just thought we would do yellow since we're going to be putting pineapple essential oil in. But you can feel free to use any color that you'd like. And you can use as little or as less as you would like. So I'm pretty satisfied with this color. Next, I'm going to be putting a few drops of essential oil. And again, this is something that you can put as much or little in as well. If you would like it a little bit stronger, or if you would like just a hint. And we're just gonna mix that all together, and we are pretty much done. This is ready to use. I like to keep mine by my kitchen sink and use it when I wash my hands. But you also can use it in a bathtub, you can use it for yourself or you can give this as a gift. I'm gonna be putting mine into a four ounce mason jar. And if you are picking this up as one of our program kits that we are currently offering, all of the materials will be in there, including the jar. And we've also added a small piece of twine in case you'd like to give it as a gift. You can add a bow on there and it will be all set. So I'm just going to smush this over with my spoon a little bit and then clean up our edges. Not too bad of a mess today. And then this is what those few ingredients will make for you. So I really hope that you enjoy the sugar scrub and feel free to be creative. Thank you and have a good day.